Golfing World recently caught up with Jeremy Dale, one of the world's specialists in trick shots. What he does makes normal golf shots seem quite simple. We met up with the Englishman at Celtic Manor and he taught us some of the secrets behind his impressive play. The trick is to get the club right next to the ball and then scoop it. It's like a wristy scoop, so the club is literally is literally catching the ball up and scooping it up and then you hit it and then you catch it. So one more time and then we'll move on. Flick it, hit it up. And when you're juggling, just one little tip, don't get the club too far away and don't bounce the ball too high. So if you want to do, see how many you can get, do little bounces close to you. The further away you get and the more you, uh, and the higher it goes, the, the more difficult it is. Whereas bounce, 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 you could do this all day because it's more or less underneath the eye line. Yeah. Anyway, then what he did was um, swapped hands, swapped hands back, and then he went under one leg. Went through his legs. <laughs> well, I needed Tiger to give me the ideas, frankly. <laughs> uh, then he had a rest, obviously, uh, and, uh, and caught the ball. Uh, Popped it back, caught it again, flipped it up, down on. Uh, this actually is quite interesting because I can hit this nearly as far uh, as when I stand to it normally. Really? Yeah, yeah. Now it shows you, I suppose, the value of good hand action. You can do it with, uh, with trainers much more easily actually than golf shoes, but I always use a towel. Now, have I got this the right distance? Yeah. Now, I'm a little bit close to the ball, actually, but I'll grip down the shaft and try and hit this one first. The high tee shot. Only self-respecting professional golf trick shot artist will be able to do this. Actually, people find this unbelievably difficult. But it's not. Not for me, anyway. And. Um, a great shot to be able to challenge people to. Just do one more of those. <clears throat> Just gone a bit lower. To be a good trick shot artist, you've got to be able to do the high tee shot. And um, the secret, if you like, to, to doing this one is that uh, it, obviously it's on, on a different angle, so you've got to adjust your posture to compensate for that. Now, with, the, um, with the, the ball on the middle of these tees, it's obviously a very rounded baseball kind of swing. So instead of tipping over for, uh, for the ball on the ground, as you would, you have to raise up. If the ball was up here, you'd have to tilt back. And the, the shoulder line that you'd swing on would be reflected in the, in the posture. You always turn your shoulders at 90 degrees to your posture. So if you're vertical, that's good because you can then turn horizontally and that'll make the arm swing much more horizontal. So the club will be flat here and flat there and you've a chance then of, uh, of coming back at the, uh, at the right height. So if I just show you one, you see how the posture is actually quite different to a normal shot. 